Let's now begin by coding a simple Hello World application. This task only requires one line of code in Python. In our video title, Visual Studio Code, we have shown how to set up a Python folder. We assume that this has been successfully set up as previously shown. Let's open file python underscore module dot py and type our simple hello world application. As you write, you can see Visual Studio Code IntelliSense providing code suggestions. We now want to execute this simple script. First, we make sure the right Python environment is selected. We select Python 365. We can now execute this simple script by performing a right click on the Python module name and by selecting run Python file in terminal. Now that your code is ready, you may want to save your workspace so that you can then easily reopen it later on. Select file from the menu and then save workspaces. Then type a name and confirm. Let's now recap the structure of a Python project. A Python project features a top-level package, which is the root directory containing all project sub-packages and modules. There are empty underscore underscore init underscore underscore dot py files telling Python what subdirectories contain modules. Mind that it is not a good practice to use the same name for packages and modules. Our original Hello World application featured a single line of code. Let's now consider a slightly more sophisticated implementation. In line 1, we define a function hello underscore msg that returns our hello world string. This function is called in line 5 by the print statement. Functions are defined via keyword def followed by the function name, two round brackets, and a colon. The body of the function is the set of statements that are executed when the function is called. In Python, a four-space indentation is used to identify statements that belong to the body of the function. In our case, statement return, hello world, in line 2. Python modules can be imported into other modules. If module hello underscore world dot py is imported, the if statement in line 4 makes sure that the code in line 5 is not executed. Let's demonstrate this on a practical case. We create a new module new underscore module dot py in package python underscore project. From module python underscore module in package python underscore package, we import function hello underscore msg. We can now invoke this function as if it were defined in module new underscore module. It is good practice to add comments to your code. This makes it easier for other people to understand the structure and the purpose of the code. Comments can be inserted by typing a hash followed by the comment text. Additionally, Python features docstring comments. These are structured comments inserted at the beginning of the body of a function. The text in these comments is displayed by coding environments that feature IntelliSense like Visual Studio Code. As an assignment, please take now a minute or two to develop and execute module Fibonacci in sub-package mathematics. The module features a procedure that prints the first n Fibonacci series elements.